have the latest coronavirus numbers here in Ohio. Health officials report 31,408 cases with 1,956 deaths. More than 5,400 people have been hospitalized with the virus since the pandemic began. Well, Memorial Day weekend is considered the unofficial start of summer, with people usually getting together for cookouts, camping, and just getting outside. Now, that is still happening, but the coronavirus is making things a little different this year. NBC 4's Eric Halperin is at Alum Creek State Park tonight. A busy place, but maybe not with as many people this weekend. Eric? Mark, that's because people aren't allowed to visit those that are staying here this weekend. The campgrounds here at Alum, St Alum Creek State Park are full and usually people come here and visit their family and friends, but that cannot happen this year because of COVID-19. They better follow the rules because this stuff is dangerous. Joan McClaskey wasn't enforcing the rules at Allen Creek State Park, but she had a pretty good vantage point to see if they were being followed. But I haven't seen any big groups of teenagers or anybody that's really causing a problem or anything. She sat by the boat ramp Saturday, watching as boats were put in or taken out and as they buzzed by. Like it does every year, the Ohio Department of Natural Resources is reminding people to boat safely. This Memorial Day weekend, officers are also making sure people are social distancing. We're just doing, doing our part to maintain that distance. Sergeant Andy Foo says while they're not very likely to find social distancing issues out on the water, the same can't be said for the campgrounds. Unfortunately, due to the uh, the COVID issues we have going on, uh, there's absolutely no visitors uh, to the campgrounds. And the only people that are permitted on the site are the registered uh, the registered campers, as long as they're from one household. Every campsite is being used this weekend, and usually on Memorial Day weekend, other visitors come for things like cookouts. But this year, he says if a site is found with visitors, the whole site can be evicted. Officers are also reminding groups they can't be gathering together. We don't want to invite large groups of people and congregating. That defeats the whole purpose uh, that the, the world is facing right now as far as, far as the, the social distancing. And as of this afternoon, officers had not had to kick anyone out for having visitors. Live and local for you at Allen Creek State Park, I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4. All right, Eric, thank you.